welcome to part two. Actually, it's video number seven. Haha. <laughs> Jazz hands. Um, we'll just pick up right back where we left off from the last video. Um, recap. Recap. We talked about general pain caused by this topic. The lack of training, lack of knowledge, really. Um, the Christian hateful view of, you know, the war, and I suggested some theology books. Now moving on to the singing set. All right. So really, what what started these videos um, was. Uh, this video that I saw, and I'm positive you know what I'm talking about, uh, of this Baptist pastor, and, <clears throat> sorry, I recorded this, like, hundreds of times, my lips are getting a little bit dry, and my voice is, <coughs> getting a little raspy, um, of this Baptist pastor, and he made the statement that he knew how to fix the gay problem, and uh, all that he had to do was round up all the gays, put them behind this closed-in fence, uh, airdrop them food, and eventually they would die off. <laughs> the funny thing is, though, usually these crazy elitist guys, usually they say something like, oh, just round them all up and kill them. But he didn't. He didn't. That's why I love it so much. He says instead, you know, just they'll, they'll just die off, you know, like... <laughs> And it's got to be one of the most ignorant things I've ever heard. Wait, wait, wait. No, 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 yeah. It is the most ignorant thing I've ever heard. Ever. Ever. Dumb. Okay. Just want to go on record saying I do not agree with it at all. I am Christian. Yes. I believe that, that the Bible is the inerrant, infallible word of God, which is our complete guide for faith and daily living. I absolutely believe that. 100%. I believe that Christ is the only way to heaven. I am a Christian. However, this guy's attitude is way off base. Way off base. And it mirrors what so many Christians are thinking. So many Christians are thinking. Oh, it just irks me. And then also, what it's not just how he said it, the attitude that he said it in, but it's also what he said. First off, if you killed every every gay person today, there'd be more tomorrow, because gay is not something that you can just purge from people. It's not like think about poor people. You can't just kill off all the poor people, and then tomorrow there won't be any more poor people to fill in the gaps. No, no, no. then there'll be more poor people. It's the exact same kind of thing. There's a few things that really irks me about this and this pa Baptist pastor's uh, 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 statement. Um, number one, it's so judgmental. Like, you just listen to it and you go, and you just get this nasty taste in your mouth, like, I just ate something bad. Like, how can such ugly things come out of someone? Just, ugh. Uh, number two, it's unloving. It's so hateful. Oh. Number three, it's so self-righteous. Like, this guy, when he says that he's all posted behind his pulpit, like, ooh, look at me. I'm high class. You know, and the whole time he's saying it, he's just saying something real dumb, and he's got that look on his face like, like, I'm saying something real good, but he's not. He's saying something real dumb. And, you know, it's just such, so self-righteous. Oh, it just irks me. Ugh. And then, uh, 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 this guy does not understand. The way he talks about homosexuals, he doesn't understand their psyche at all. I would almost guarantee he has never had a gay friend. Never. In fact, I'm not even sure if he ever climbed down from his golden altar or, or throne room long enough to even get acquainted with a ho even see a homosexual in real life. He's probably only read about them in books. Um, wow, I was just, I totally do not agree with the statement. Do not agree at all. Um, it was disgusting, FYI. Um, disgusting statement, and it had no love of Christ. I want to drive that into the ground. Disgusting statement. Um, so I don't know if I said this in the last video, but, um, actually I think I did, about the kid getting kicked out, 
um, by his parents. And you know, that's really the attitude there. there. It's either this attitude of, oh, just, it's whatever. Or it's this attitude of, to the other extreme of, oh, ah, oh, I hate them. You know, it kind of reminds me of, uh, of uh, Hitler and the Jews, you know. Oh, I gotta kill them all, you know. It's, we're seeing the exact same attitude in these Christians. Oh, we gotta kill them all. It's gonna be like the uh, the, the Crusades all over again. Um, uh, really, Christians, stop looking down on them, okay? The Bible says that our righteousness is as rags. Dirty, filthy rags. Okay? Um, just... Aww. Oh, disconnected. Bummer. Why won't it come?